election day around the corner when local organization is hoping young people will make their voices heard. With long lines for the ballot boxes at City Hall, it was the perfect opportunity for Vote That John to connect with all voters through music. <laughs> Oh, it's fantastic. It's a great way to stand in line and wait to vote. <laughs> well, I went to the Performing Arts High School, and I'm currently studying architecture at Drexel. It's definitely a good reaction that I get from people, so I just like to put smiles on people's faces with my music. I think it's very relaxing. It's helped my experience a lot. It's my first time voting. I was very excited, and he's playing all songs that are on my playlist. <laughs> Vote That John has been working since 2018 to educate and organize young people to vote. Right now, we're trying to draw attention to all the early voting sites. We brought some music out to help people while they stand in line and maybe make them stand in line a little longer. It's like exhausting standing here and then like having to wait 20 minutes to get in. So like, I like to give them a show. If you're gonna wait in line, you might as well have some fantastic music to listen to. He's excellent. I'm kind of distracted. The line's been long and I was too focused on his beautiful songs. Very emotional songs. I appreciated it. I think there's such a connection between art and organizing and it really draws people in. It gets them to commit to a message. It's really a natural combination to bring art and community together. Sounds nice, and much thanks to photojournalist Dan Sheridan for that musical report.